All right, it's time to see what's clicking in Cleveland. And for that, we bring in our tech expert who actually told me what to do. Yes, just Because I didn't know. She said, just hit it. We'll just see what happens. And I, I hit it. Hi, Stephanie. That's it. Hi, guys. All right, here's what's clicking in Cleveland. You know what? Yeah, I can definitely handle those tag alongs, too, by the way. I'll take, I'll take the other five million. You got, so got that covered. First up, my very favorite holiday in the world is the 4th of July, also known as Jay's birthday. Want to let you know where you can see those fireworks this year. In Akron, they're doing it at four spots, totally synchronized, very cool, lined up with music on 97.5. That's at 9.45 p.m. on July 4th. And in Canton, they are bringing them back at the McKinley Monument. That's on July 4th at 9.50 p.m. Okay, on to the rest of our clicking stories. Now, a few of our Northeast Ohio cities rank among the best beachfront lake towns in the country. This is according to the 2021 rankings of the best beach towns along the lakefront to live in, just polished today by Wallet Hub. We have three places in the top 25. At number 13, Rocky River. Bay Village comes in at number 20, and Vermilion, Ohio comes in at number 24. The top city on the list, by the way, Traverse City, Michigan. Now, the Lake County Humane Society wants your help with stuffing an entire bus with donations to take care of kittens. They need all kinds of things, from dry cat food and milk substitutes to digital kitchen scales and those little gel microwavable heating pads. And while you're there, you can also adopt a kitten. That costs $120. This is at the Humane Society in Menor from 1 to 3 p.m. on Saturday or Catter day, if you will. And I learned something new this week on our weekly YouTube show, It's All Good News. Apparently, cow hugs are a thing. The Gentle Barn is a sanctuary in California that's been rescuing and rehabbing animals for more than 20 years. They also offer cow hugs. And more and more people asked for them to drop in for cow hugging sessions throughout the pandemic. People came from all over to do this. And that is just one of our good news stories, meant to give you a little midweek Pick me up. That drops every Wednesday at 1 p.m. on the WKYC YouTube page. But yeah, Jay and Betsy, apparently you hug a cow and it kind of hugs you back and people find it utterly moving, utterly they say. Moving. Okay, that's a dad joke. That was a good one. That's a, that's a dad joke for sure. Little demonstration for you there. Happy to provide a dad joke. We have to go. I took up so much time with the Facebook Live. We'll be right back. <laughs> Our producer's mad.